welcome everybody to the 10th and final part of my Uncharted 2 replay. It's time to get through the entire adventure in Shambhala and defeat Lazarevich once and for all. And the final alternate skin that I give in Nate is the skeleton of Sir Francis Drake. Even though I showed it off briefly in an earlier part, but I'm going to be uh, sticking with it for the final part. Now, part 10, it's gonna... Well, there's gonna be plenty of frustration here. Plenty of ambushes, and it's the, the last of the ambushes. And, and of course, there will be the final boss against Lazarevich. The first thing that's gonna happen here... Well, first I gotta remember where I go to trigger the first ambush. And hold on a sec, I... My ear was itching. Wait, there's a grenade here. More of those freaks. Take oh my them. god. Here. Well, what did Lazar bitch call them? Guardians or something? Now these guys... Hard to kill, that's what. Yeah, what, what Francis Drake said. All you have to do really is just continuously shoot them until they finally decide to die. And the, the crossbows they carry, they, they deal a plenty of damage to you. However, their crossbows is also the best weapon to use against them. As soon as you finally kill one, you can get its crossbow and use it against them. Crap! Oh my god. Am I dead here? Must keep moving, must keep moving. Okay, I'm not dead. Oh, Jesus. I really hate these guys. Who doesn't? I hope this is the one that I've been shooting the most. Oh! Ha! You missed. This one should be almost dead. Get away from me! Just expire, for the love of God! Crap. Well, just like when they're in disguise as those creatures, you can just hit triangle and square to counter them. Oh, finally, this one's dead. And now, they're gonna see just what it feels like. Actually, I think, are there only two here, or are there three? Also, most of the time, they only take two shots with their own crossbow before dying. Yeah. See that? Their own crossbow is their greatest weakness. But now they're gonna start carrying those explosive things. Well, good thing it makes them flinch. That should be it for them. That's for sure. Well, technically, this crossbow is is a strong weapon. But of course, you don't get very much ammo for it. So, you gotta go up there. And I forget where you start climbing. Probably the other side. Bye bye, birdies. Sorry I had to scare you like that. I usually love birds. Come on, you can make these. Keep jobs. it up, girls. I've seen how well the two of you climb. A and uh, my viewers have seen how well you two worked together back in Nepal. How you doing back there? We're coming. So, you come over here, there's that resin, which, when shot... What the hell? Oh my god, what is that? The sap is flammable, just like the resin we found. Oh. Oh. warning next time, maybe. Well, it's not like you were really close to the explosion, Chloe. 
Oh, and also, the explosive sap. It's what you're gonna use against Lazarevich in the final boss. You climb the handholds, and then this rope. And there's more sap right here. And then you shoot this app. Hey, I'm shooting it. Now we're talking. Let's go. Are you women amazed? Oh boy, look at this. That looks familiar. Of course. That must be where the Chintamani stone is. No doubt Lazarevich is on his way there right now. Beautiful. This place really must have been something back in the day. Kind of quiet. It does feel kind of haunted, doesn't it? Now, yet another big ambush is going to happen around here. Just not until I trigger it. And unfortunately, there's going to be, I think, one or two of those heavily armored Gatling gun guys. And you won't be getting a rocket launcher this time. Here Whoa, they come. We got company. Again? Shh. Told you. Too damn quiet. Maybe they haven't seen us yet. Elena, get back. I want to try to stealth kill some the of them, but all over the place. there's no telling where the first one will show up. Hopefully they can't see us from up here. Should I go for that guy? I don't want to end up falling right on top of him. Well, I got him. Where are the other soldiers? I think there are two Gatling gun guys. Without a rocket launcher, of course they won't be easy to kill. You just gotta hit them with everything you got, including grenades. Crap, there's one. Thankfully, he didn't see me roll back here. We're being stalked by a skeleton. Well, I can just come back here to get these two grenades when I need some. There may be... Oh, wait. There's one over there. Keep moving, you. Or just go back. I guess I'll go for him next. Wait, I see another soldier on the other side here. Okay, I'll go for him next. I'm guessing that guy is just going to keep going back and forth. Okay, that guy had a sniper rifle. Do I want to start shooting now? Well, not until I get back up there with Elena and Chloe. To heck with it. Let's do this. Come 
Come on. Oh. I, I'm not gonna die right now. Snipers. Boy, do they make me sick. And of course, rocket launchers too. Okay, so you do get a rocket launcher after all. I forgot there was a rocket launcher soldier here. Come on, die you. I saw you dodge roll. Where'd the Gatling Gunner go? Wait, that's a dragon. That's it for your helmet. Gatling Gunner, where is he? Where are they shooting? Ooh, it sounds like I damaged someone with that sap. I don't think I need the rifle just yet. Oh no, the Guardians. I think you get a checkpoint after the Guardians show up, which is really good because I hate this ambush. Come on now, we already have enough problems here. Oh, uh, I think the Gatling Gun guy is dead. It may not be a very smart move to try to use this against the Guardians. Yeah, I I'm pretty sure it's not. You can never tell where they're going to show up. I don't even know what they're saying, nor do I care. You get off her! Get off of both of them! Uh, I think maybe I want to use the sniper rifle against them. Where was it? Or do I want to use the shotgun against them? Wait, here it is. Crap. Oh. Oh! Let me go! Oh, jump! Oh, but I was about to get stuck. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Rifle wasn't working very well. Oh, just let me... Oh my god. Just let me go! Ugh! Seriously! Well, thankfully, I was right that you get a checkpoint after they show up. What, is the shotgun not here anymore? Or even the rocky launcher.
Well, is anything else going to happen? Any more of them showing up? Perhaps the Gandolin gun was a good weapon to use against them after all. Let's hope that's finally all of them for this area. Now you need to get this gate open, but one of the counterweights is broken. So you gotta get over to its position. And... Why did that happen? So, this skeleton's about to be the new right counterweight. Alright, I'm on it. Okay, here we go. Who would have thought this skeleton could be heavy enough? Go! Move, Francis. You're cutting that a little fine. More soldiers will be down here, of course. And I forgot to get the grenades back there. And you guys can't take cover forever. Of course they kill me even though I was... Whatever. Die, Dragon! Oh my god. How does that feel? Two more! That may be just one more, I can't tell here. Sweet. Sniper. Boy, am I glad that sap was there. Elena, Chloe, are you gonna follow Francis or what? Grenade launcher. I could use this. Hey, come on, climb up. Look out. War dragons. Just perfect. But good thing I got this baby. Oh, wow, he accidentally threw a grenade up there. Nice bro, doofus. You guys all right? I don't need the rifle. Even more will be coming here, but there's some sap right here. Nice. Good thing it was just like them. Need to get up to that ledge. Let's use the cart. Here we go. That'll do it. Nice work, guys. Thanks for the help, Chloe. Don't mention it. Nice sarcasm there, Francis. Oh boy, a flight of stairs. There it is. We're about to enter... I, I'm guessing it's a palace. And, when you come here... Look at that. A billion more soldiers, but also more guardians. 
I'm not so sure if I want to start shooting now. Oh, and look at that. A Gatlin Gunner. Who is right between two more of those stabs. Oh, and look at that. He's dead. Thanks to the Guardians. Well, now I'm glad they're here. But they are going to try to kill us, too. Well, I took out the dragon for that one. Here they come. Another dragon. Come on. Get the ammo. This is going to be kind of intense. I hope at least one of these Guardians dies to the soldiers. Whoa, what? Oh my god, where did that one come from? There's a rocket launcher here. With three rounds. Sweet. And... I guess a dragon just showed up there out of nowhere. Get down. There's guardians down here too. You should probably wait until the guardians kill the Gandolin gunner before you start shooting. And definitely take out the rocket launcher too. Come on, kill him. This is kind of entertaining to watch, I have to say. While the soldiers are unaware of us, they'll just stay busy with the Guardians. Oh, Elena started shooting. Well, the Gandolin Gunner's out. How many dragons are going to be coming here? Yeah, they just got sapped. I gotta get ammo now. I think that one may have... Wait, that's a dragon. Again. Well, I'm glad he took damage from the sap. Oh yeah, there's a Gatlin gun here. Let's hope this would be a good time to use it. Oh, that's a soldier. And I finally got a hand grenade on me. He better have been the last dragon. Oh, I didn't want the machine pistol. Whatever, I'll take it. That one's dead. Uh-oh. More of them with the explosives are explosives are coming. Don't get the crossbow. I must use it against them. They just keep coming! That's another one out of the way. You tell him, Chloe. Nice try. 
You can't blow up this skeleton. Oh, thank okay. God. Well, this only took two tries. Unexpectedly. Gonna go back to this gun now. Because now that this ambush is finally done, and it's thankfully the final ambush you face before taking on Lazarevich. I don't think I want to stick with this machine pistol, but I can't find a handgun anywhere. Screw it. I think I will hold on to it. Stone's gotta be here somewhere. Let's try heading up. Right. And yes, I'm I'm totally gonna take on Lazarevich as Nate's ancestor. His dead ancestor. Come on, we better hurry. Here we come, Lazarevich. Well, not yet, actually. Oh, man, I just remembered. That... The ambush we faced wasn't the last one. There's still another. I right. I just can't... Why can't I remember there. certain things? There it is. The Chintamani Stone. I can't believe we beat them here. It's beautiful. Yep. Magnificent. Now let's smash it and get the hell out of here. Uh, wait. Something's not right. What do you mean? Marco Polo had it wrong. This isn't a sapphire, it's amber. Amber? Yeah, you know, fossilized resin. It's tree sap. Wait a minute. What is it? You gotta be shitting me. Hello, Nate. I hate it when he does this. Tell me about it. How could I have missed it? Missed what? There's not actually a stone. It's the resin, the sap from the Tree of Life. Okay, hold on. Now you've lost me. This tree. No. That tree. There he is. Lazarevich. He's headed to the tree. Oh my god. The black teeth. What? The black teeth on those guardian things and the bodies in Borneo. They ate the resin. And it changed them somehow. And you think that's what Lazarevich is planning to do? You really want to wait around and find out? Bravo, shut up. Well done. Flynn? Jesus. Oh, Harry. What's the matter, mate? Disappointed Lazara bitch beat you to it? I'm afraid you just missed him. Figured I'd stay behind and wait for you to come join my little party. What are you talking about? <laughs> Maybe that's what old Zoran wanted all along, eh? He's cleverer than he looks. Well, we can still stop him. <gasps> Elena, don't. No, we can help you. Sorry, love. This isn't a movie. And you're not the plucky girl who reforms the villain and saves the day. It's just not done like that. Flynn, listen to me. You... Parting gift from the Zarevich. Pity he took the pin. Get back! Elena! <laughs> no. Oh my god. Elena! Okay. You're gonna be okay. Come on, we're gonna get you out of here. Come on. Stop, Lazarevich, go. Not a chance. Come on. Oh, shit. It's all right, I've got her. You cover us. Right, this way. Lazarevich. Okay, well, now Flynn is dead, thankfully. So only Lazarevich remains, but now Elena is badly hurt, and we gotta get her through all this crap. Good thing I got a grenade on me this time. There are snipers everywhere, and yeah, I do get it. 
you know what's happening here. This should be the final ambush, before facing the final boss. Okay, we're gonna move. Boy, do I love being a sniper. Watch out. Okay, a little bit further. Here we go. Oh, now I get a pistol. A regular pistol. Okay, hang back. Elena better not die. She and Nate are supposed to have a daughter in the future. These better be the rest of the dragons we've faced in the whole game. Because they refuse to die for the final time. Keep going. Okay, we're gonna move. Come on. You can do it. You gotta keep up with us, Elena. Stay with us. Nate really can't bear Come to on, lose you. That's the last of them. Hey. Hey, Elena, how you doing, huh? Not good. You just hang in there, okay? I'm counting on you. Head for the gate. Go as fast as you can. What, what, what do you mean? No. No way. Look, Chloe, I have to end this. No, you don't. Don't you dare take on this stupid crusade. Just get her out of here. Not without you. Look, if that stuff could really transform Lazarevich and his army... Please don't do this. If it could actually make him invincible, and I didn't try to stop it... But this is suicide. And you know it. Just go. Get as far away from this place as you can. It may be suicide. But Francis is totally willing to take that chance. Lazarevich needs to be stopped. And this here is the final- What in the world? Okay, what the heck just happened right there? I was moving normally and... Suddenly it looks like I just got launched over here. Uh, but I was saying, this here is the final chapter. You have got to be kidding me. Ah, <laughs> oh, shit. It's time to end this, Lazarevich. For real and for true. So, this here is what the final boss is like. Running all around until you can get Lazarevich close enough to the staff, and then you shoot it. I think there are... maybe three phases? Or are there four?
Come on, Zoran. Uh, no! That was phase one. You think you can stop me? Oh yes, I can. And I will. You can get hand grenades here, but okay, he got lucky right there to. Yeah, that could actually happen. The hand grenades, they're not exactly all that useful for this fight. I mean, Zarovich does constantly run around after all. I'm right here, Zoran. No! Yes, I know I can stop you. You think you can stop me? You think it's too late to stop you? Think again. Of course, he will move faster later on. Obviously, you want to stay out of that fire. Come on, come on, move. That shotgun of yours doesn't scare me one bit. Climb up. That's it. Oh, uh, I'm not sure if I damaged him there. Jesus Christ! Come on. Come on, you big ugly bitch. Bring it on! How many explosions does it take for the second phase? Okay, that was it. You will not stand in the way of destiny! Oh yes, I will! I think this may be where he starts throwing hand grenades. Three of them. Of course he has an infinite supply of grenades, and he always throws three at once. Oh, I think I did damage him there. Boop, boop. So there are four faces to the final boss. You have some of this. Shoot, shoot, shoot. Come on. I'm still here, Lazarevich. I'm not going anywhere until you're dead. Your grenades don't scare me either. You realize that. Good. Final phase. I will kill you, Lazarevich. Just keep falling right into my traps. I, I, I didn't want to fall down there. Incoming. Climb! Where'd he go? Oh my god. Wait, does he, for, does he throw four grenades? Come on, don't get stuck now. I am bringing it on. Oh, come on. I wanted to shoot that. Why can't you climb faster, Francis? Oh, shut up already and... Wait, did he just damage himself there? I hope he did. Like the idiot he and all of his soldiers are. Oh boy. It feels like this tree is starting to crumble. You gotta finish him off fast. Don't hang from the edge, just... Oh, for a second I thought I was about to fall to my death. Like I timed my jump, not, like I didn't time my jump right there.
Oh, thank you, Christ. You're no different from me, Drake. How many men have you killed? How many just today? That's it, boy. No compassion. No mercy. Huh? Do it! No. <laughs> you don't have the will. Maybe not. They do. Well, as our bitch may finally be done for, but there's still one thing left to do. Get back to Chloe and Elena without dying here. As this bridge crumbles. Move it, Francis. Get a move on. Crap is right. Move it, birds. Well, these guardians are dead, thankfully. Holy god. That's it. Keep grabbing the ledges. You're almost there. Nate? Oh dear god, no, not Chloe. You better get your stinking hands off her right now. That's it. The game's done. Just hold on. Come on, stay with us. You're gonna be okay, all right? You're gonna be fine. You're gonna be just fine. Elena, don't do this. Elena! So, it's been a long, strange trip, hasn't it? Yes, it has. <laughs> you know, you should play the hero more often. It suits you. Nah. Tell me something, Nate. What? Do you love her? Chloe, I'm sorry. No, it's fine. Really, it's all right. Just do yourself a favor, cowboy. Tell her. Chloe. No. My turn to walk away. But admit it. You're gonna miss this ass. <laughs> well, look who's not supposed to be out of bed. Yeah. 
He's a lousy patient. Stubborn as all hell. I'm not stubborn, I'm just restless. <laughs> so, no giant sapphire. Once again, no. <laughs> and you're sure of that? Yes. <laughs> just a metaphor, I'm afraid. Metaphor ain't gonna pay your bills, kid. Well, something else will come along. Just gotta have faith. Yeah. That and a quarter will get you 25 cents. <laughs> uh, which way'd Chloe go? See you later. Oh, no. <laughs> You're a dirty old man, Sullivan. Uh-huh. <sighs> you did good, Nate. I think he'd approve. Yeah? Uh-huh. So where do we go from here, huh? I don't know. <laughs> I haven't thought that far ahead. Of course not. <laughs> but then again, neither have I. Good. So, on a scale of one to ten, how scared were you that I was gonna die? Four. Four? Yeah, why? A four. four. Yeah. You were at least an eight. An eight? You were a total eight. An eight? Those guardian things were an eight. Are you kidding me? Yeah, those were terrifying. What's a ten? Clowns. Clowns over my death? I... I hate clowns. clowns. I hate clowns. Oh, my word. You thought I was dead. No. No, you thought I was no, gone. No. Yes, you did. No, I, I saw had you, you shed along. tears. You shed a bunch of them. Tears? Uh -huh. It was raining. No, it was not. <laughs> you were unconscious and it was raining. It was totally sunny out and you were bawling. It wasn't sunny. You were unconscious. Whatever. I kept your tears in a jar. I have proof. I'll give you five. How's that? Oh, I bet you kept Nate's tears in a jar. I'm willing to bet. That's it. The end of Uncharted 2. And I tell you, that final boss against Lazarevich, to me anyway, it was it's definitely the hardest boss fight in the entire Uncharted series. The rest of the boss fights in the other games, they're definitely not as hard. In fact, uh, I think the, the final boss in Uncharted 3 is entirely revolved around Quake Time events, kind of. Basically making that the easiest boss fight in the series. But yes, I'm definitely saying the, the Lazarevich fight is the hardest. So, it's end credits time now. Oh yes, and I will consider replaying Uncharted 3. Just not... It, it just won't be my next playthrough. In fact, I gotta play the whole game off-camera first. So I can get a mil... Or be familiar with it again. It's not really my favorite game in the whole Uncharted series, but I will replay it eventually, at some point in the future. And yes, the same thing with Uncharted 4 and The Lost Legacy.
Okay, credit's over, right? Yep, that's it. No, no post credit scene or anything like that. Before I end the playthrough, though, just for giggles, though, I decided to, you know, show off all 101 treasures that you can get in the game, unlike in the first part. And to show you what they look like, too. Well, I'm not really gonna rotate all of them. You know, it just takes too long, but... You do find plenty of rings in the game. Oh yeah, and uh, before I or as I play Uncharted 3 off-camera, I I think I may think about collecting every treasure in that game as well. I may, though. I mean, I, I never did do so with Drake's Fortune, but... Well, I, since I've done so for this game... Wow, that's a pretty fancy pocket watch. But since I did so with this game, I might as well do the same with the rest of the games in the series. And of course, I did already show the strange relic back in part one. It's just some kind of golden egg with symbols on it. I wonder if the strange relic looks any different in Drake's Fortune. And Uncharted 3. Yeah, I'm pretty sure Uncharted 1 through 3 have strange relics. Don't know about the other games, though. And no, I can't record a playthrough of the, uh, the handheld game Uncharted Golden Abyss. That's on the PlayStation Vita, and I have no PS Vita capture device. Wait a minute, this is supposed to be a lion? Hardly even looks like one. You also do find several treasures that have Tibetan in the name. Singing Bull? <laughs> okay then, that's an odd name. trumpet? I wonder if it's actually playable. Like, can it actually make a sound when blown? Oh, this is an earring, not a finger ring.
Oh, there's another earring. Definitely doesn't look comfortable to wear on any earlobe. And the last one. Okay, that's all the treasures. So, my Uncharted 2 Among Thieves replay is complete. I'm pretty sure a lot of you enjoy this game, maybe even more than Drake's Fortune. Not sure if anybody would find Uncharted 3 or 4 or Lost Legacy any better, but Uncharted 2 is still very good. It really is one of the best games of 2009. But now, that's going to be it. Thank you for watching, people. I shall see you next time in my next playthrough, whatever it's going to be. Bye, everyone.